Of course, I don't want it too loud because we don't want sticky nut juice. A fucking OG at this point. Hey, turn your volume up. I can't turn it up any louder or I'm going to get I'm going to get a copyright strike. And I don't want it too loud because oh, they sound moist. They are. Yeah, I was just talking about Invincible. I love it. OK. Yeah. So we were talking on a stream the other day about Odin and how and the missteps with Odin's decision. Where even in the anime, it's still like, yeah, I'm going to review the entire season. I might even rewatch it the entire season before I review it. <laughs> Kaido's laugh is growing on me so much. I wasn't too upset at Odin. I was just upset that like how it was handled. It's more of a writing thing as opposed to an Odin thing. It was like, okay, it's a bit confusing. Okay. I think we saw this in the last episode. But it's gonna turn into a fing bolt. Yo, they 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 rethinking this shit now. Oh my god, bro. This is a beast. Wait, was that like green and red? Hold on. As soon as you sync to that, I ran it back. My fault. This is Nobu. Damn! That is you. Yeah, that was that was clean how Ryzo just ran in there. Who is this? Oh, Toki. Yasu, man. Yasu's more of a legend in my eyes now, but I think he just grew up, Krolo. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. His head is a lot longer now. If Odin loses. Oh man. The red string of fate. She just snipped it. Look at look at Queen. Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Is he holding a lantern? So he's holding blue fire. Oh, wait, why is his blue though? Is this foreshadowing that this nigga gonna kill Marco and use his flames as a lantern? And I was thinking as well, what are the chances? Or in Kaido's crew, who is the other Conqueror's hockey user? Is it King or somebody else? None. No, they, there has to be more because of what Kaido said about the, uh, having too many Conquerors. And I mean, King should have it. It's in his name. Alti is another one that's sneaky because there's some moments there, but Kaido probably doesn't want a Conqueror's hockey user in his crew. Oh, uh, you think based off of the Rock stuff? Maybe. No, yeah, he was talking about Kid and Luffy, but it's like, based on how he said it, it was kind of implied about, um, it could be the Rock's Pirates thing, could have referred to Rock's, but it's like, it's not about not having any, but not having too many Conquerors. So I don't think you'll just refuse a, conquerors be a Conqueror being on his crew, because I think there's definitely another Conqueror on his crew. Kaido's menacing, bro. Is this Windscar? No, that's his hyper beam. Oh, I thought Odin was just going to cut through it. Well, I guess he did. Yo, this man is different, bro. Why would he give up? <laughs> At this point, Jack is eight years old. So, <laughs> they're sending the troops. What's up, John? Oh, who fights him? Okay. Oh, the king doesn't have his mechanical arm yet. Yo, king is so clean, bro. I mean, Queen doesn't have his mechanical arm. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. What the f Oh, my God, bro. This is so f beautiful. Okay. Odin ain't done, play ba. I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't say. After my boy Big K, it's, uh, it's Kiku. He's been waiting for a guy like Odin. See, now this is going to add to what happens and what transpires because... Now we know Kaido is enjoying this, right? Kaido's enjoying this. So what transpired, the sequence of events, it makes a lot more sense. Where the anime is doing Kaido's, I think, character a lot more justice than the manga did. And this this whole fight, a lot more justice than the manga did. Where in the manga, it wasn't even clear Odin was using Congress Hockey. But the episode, that shit was beautiful. Wano anime, as good as the manga is, is easily better. Easily better. Oh shit! Real, definitely real. Oh my god, that's the that's a strike. What? What the? F Yo, <laughs> yo, even Kaido said Nani. <laughs> oh my god! Yo, that nigga felt that. You heard? You heard that nigga scream? <laughs> He's like Nani. Look at this shit. My God! The next, uh, oh my! He was done. What? Hold on, Pip. My bad. My bad. That's Bagua. That's Bagua. That's Bagua. Oh my gosh! This is so good. What the hell? No! No! Oh, okay, okay, okay.
This is so much better. This, bro, this is so much better. So, bro, this is, this is so much fucking better because in the manga, it made it seem like Odin looked back and then Kaido was like, still like, fuck it. This nigga was mid attack and Odin turned around. Damn, bruh. Wow. She fucked up one of the best fights that we could have had in a story. She fucked it up. I, I know Kaido is mad. The first time he gets scarred, and he even said in the episode, this is the man he's been waiting for. And then she jumps in and does some foul shit. Wait, we just halfway through him? Oh, man. It makes sense. It makes so much more sense. That is, that is tough. That is tough. I like this. I liked what they did here because Kaido was mid-strike. And that looked just like a Thunder Bagua. I mean, he didn't say it. But that's pretty much what it was, right? It was a fucking Thunder Bagua. And he took that straight on from the back of the head. And he wasn't knocked out immediately. He even retained some consciousness. This episode is so beautiful. Why does this feel like a movie, though? Oh, the OST. Mm. Ungrateful bastards. Like, like I said, Shinobu being mad at law, it's... You know how crazy this is? That he's fighting for these people and they're excited to see people get boiled that were fighting for them. People are sheep. Yo, Toki is strong, bro. Toki is strong for holding it down like she has. Yo, whoever the traitor is, is a sick n***a. <laughs> because, <laughs> because, <laughs> anyway, shut up, bro. Yo, this yeah, it's going to cut off. I hate this n***a. Kaido's not saying anything. Oh, shit. Oh, that is awesome. That nigga burned immediately, my nigga. Damn, bro. Kaido. This is crazy. That, yo. That episode is going to be tough. This is going to be a rough episode next week, man. That's going to be a rough episode. Holy shit. Oh, man. Next week is going to be tough. I'm not going to lie to y'all. Next week is going to be tough. It was in the back. Oh, sh you're right. <laughs> we'll cut this out. Next episode is going to be rough, boys and girls. Next episode is going to be rough. I'm, I'm probably reacting to the next episode as well. Um, Odin, man. Start doubting me, I felt lost 